Hi guys! Thanks for tuning in to Zen Romance Tarot. Today, we're taking a look at Virgo. Hi Virgos! What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? You know, we got a, um, a new moon coming up. I don't know, you know where you are in the world, but here it's about to happen tonight. So I just want to take a look and see what's going on with Virgo. Virgo! What should you be focusing on um, for the month of August? What are your main concerns? What are you going into August with? I like some messages. I am using Messages from the Mermaids by Karen Kay. Mm, I like them. They're cool. Nice quality card. First time really using them. I haven't just opened them, so we'll see. We'll see how I feel. So far, they feel really good. They're nice, light. They seem like they get to the point. We'll see. Haven't really done any study or anything like that. So, Virgo, 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 Virgo. Uh, I don't know how deep this is gonna get. So, let's just take these out. All right. What's going on in the month of August for Virgo? What should Virgo be focused on? What is concerning Virgo? Friendship. Okay. Friendship. Okay. You should be focused on your friendships, it says. Okay. Making sure you're there for the people who need you. Making sure that they're there for you. You maintain relationships. They maintain relationships with you. All right. What else should Virgo be focusing on for the month of August 2020? Re-energize. Hmm, Virgo, you tired? Mentally tired? Overly worked? Give me one more card. I have no stand. Great. Give me one more card. To show me what Virgo should be focused on. Okay, that one wanted to jump out. Blessings. Okay. Ooh, that jumped out real fast. Okay. So, Virgo, for the month of August 2020, you want to be focused on friendship. You want to make sure you are there for whoever needs you. This is what your journey for this month is going to be about stepping outside yourself, making yourself a little bit more available when you're not normally available in terms of topic meaning Virgo does not have a problem shooting the crap about you know mundane things like oh yeah I just bought a new pocketbook or all oh, the color is purple this month you probably are gonna really um, need to be that person for your person or your people or your family or your friends or however it goes make yourself available this month you're gonna be needed and it's funny because friendship is not just friendship. Friendship it displays itself in many forms. You could have a friend you talk to every day. You could have a friend you haven't spoken to in years. And then when you guys reconnect, it's just like it never ended. You could have somebody at work who depends on you, shoulder to cry on. Friendship comes in many forms. There are different, there's definitely levels to friendship. But whatever form this month you have to be a friend, you need to be a friend. Okay? I'm not saying let people throw the energy on you this is obviously within reason because we know how Virgo is so the next focus for Virgo is going to be to re-energize mental exhaustion worry things are not the same as they used to be we know that and it's, 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 it's alarming to have to fin finagle and navigate through this new normal. When you still have to go to work, you still got bills to pay, you still got to worry about family members. It takes a mental toll. I'm also seeing that there may be people who are at a distance from you. And it creates worry. There are some family members you may not have spoken to in a while, a child you haven't spoken to. You need to re-energize. The next one. 
blessings. Virgo, this month you need to focus on all of your blessings. And to me, that's how this whole message ties in. All right? Blessings. You need to focus on what it is you have. Thank whoever you praise for all that he gave you and giving you the strength to keep going. You need to reflect on everything you've been given. Don't be so worried. Just make yourself available. You have to have that space. Okay? Because I think the best way to put it is, um, I'm trying to think of the best way. To whom much is given, much is received. And I know it sounds crazy, but you got to work to get blessings. You have to be a friend to get blessings. These two cards together, friendship blessings, right? And the thing is, we know in between there, we know you got to re-energize yourself, but it needs to be, it needs to be a healthy balance, okay? Because you have, you have, um, you have an assignment this month, and it is to keep yourself mentally available and find balance. And your balance can be found by giving thanks for your blessings. All right. Uh, what I want to do is kind of ask. Why Virgo needs to re-energize? Like, is it an affair of the heart? Is it work? Clarify, please. Please, ancestors, please clarify why Virgo needs to re-energize. Please clarify why Virgo needs to re-energize. Is it re-energize or is it they just need to recategorize the way they think and, and categorize what is a blessing versus what is a hassle, right? Okay. What's going on with Virgo? Why does Virgo, why is Virgo need to be energized? Why is Virgo tired? Ten of rods. Okay, so this could have to do with the Aries, a Leo, a Sagittarius. It has to do with, uh, I'm going to say in this case, kind of like warrior mentality, very active. Uh, let's see. Because it, it, then it's like, it, it's either the ending or the beginning. Hold on, because we do go into blessings mode. So four of rods, when we look at four of rods again... That has to do with action, travel, creativity. Okay. So when we're looking at this card in relation, stability, order, protection, practicality. Okay. I think I'm starting to understand. card please five of rods there's some sort of conflict with what communication is it a person communication with what is this affairs at heart is this having to do with work communicating with who the star card this is a star of wishes this is usually the star of dreams coming true. It's not a bad card, but let's see how, how it plays out. What is it? What are you wishing for? 